guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm your host Sean, and today in this video, we're gonna talk about Black Mass. See, for like the last three videos on my channel, I've been talking about Birds of Prey because the Birds of Prey movie is coming out February 6th in Australia. So yeah, it's coming out like next week, whatever. I mean, next in like two weeks, sorry, not next week. So yeah, but um, like I did a, a video on Birds of Prey about the team. I did a video on Black Canary, who's one of the main characters in Birds of Prey, and I did a video on Huntress, who's another main character in Birds of Prey. Now, in this video, I'm gonna talk about Roman Sionis, aka Black Mask, and he is going to be the main villain of the Black uh, of the Birds of Prey movie. And in this video, I'm gonna tell you everything you need to know about him, his origin, his history, everything. Also, Black Mass is going to be played by Ian McGregor, okay, who is Obi-Wan Kenobi. Hello there. So yeah, that's that's pretty cool. <laughs> so yeah, without further ado, let's get into video and talk about uh, Black Mass. Black Mass's real name is uh, Roman Sionis, and he first appeared in Batman issue 386 in 1985. His, his parents were um, these rich... Gotham socialites who only cared about more about their fame, about their social standing than their own son. So yeah, he didn't really have good parents. So yeah, and after and moments after he was born, he was dropped as a baby. Like yeah, it was, he was dropped as a baby, and he was evil apparently. Who knows? So yeah, and he grew up, and you know he didn't really have a good childhood. His parents weren't really good people, like I said. So yeah, but when he came of age, he became the vice president of his dad's company, Janus. Um, cosmetics so yeah he then dated this woman named Cersei and he and he hired her a part of the company however his parents didn't like that mostly because it would like ruin their like fame and stuff like it would affect their social standing and stuff so as you do he um Roman science killed his parents by burning them and in, in burning the house yeah he murdered them by burning the house so yeah he obviously inherited the whole company so like I said Roman science he gets his father's company, his parents' company, and fortune, and he is obsessed with masks. He gets, he collects them and shit. So yeah, and then um, he was a poor businessman. He destroyed his own company, and he did not make good decisions and made a lot of mistakes. And Cersei, his girlfriend or whatever, leaves him and stuff. So yeah, he was like, he was in a midlife crisis, and this broke them down. So he um, goes where his parents were buried, and then he got struck by lightning. Because, why not? And he somehow didn't get injured, whatever, so yeah. But anyway, he started um, smashing his father's ca casket with a stone. And then he was carving a piece of his father's casket lid into a black mask. He then gets the identity of black mask and wears it and becomes black mask. And obviously becomes a criminal in Gotham and stuff. And he gets a game called the face False Face Society. And the gimmick is wearing mask and shit, so yeah. And obviously they became enemies to Batman. So yeah, he becomes Black Mask, he gets a gang called the um, False Face Society, and he goes after everyone that uh, tried to destroy him as Roman science. He goes after them and been trying to kill them and shit. Eventually, Batman goes after him and stuff. And this led to a confrontation where Black Mask accidentally fell in, into a firehouse and whatever. He, that was a house on fire. And um, the mask, the Black Mask, was burned into his face permanently, like forever, this... Black Mass was burned, so yeah, but for years, Black Mass was always, like, this crime dude fighting a Batman and stuff, and then, and then like, in the 90s, his gang become, like, a cult, like, they worshipped him in cult, whatever, and his face became more fucked up and more disfigured and stuff, so yeah, but then, like, in the early 2000s, they got rid of that and turned Black Mass into, like, this kingpin business crime boss controlling, like, many, um, friggin', um, controlling many parts of the city and stuff so yeah and um he loves torturing people he loves like fucking up their faces and stuff he loves doing that so yeah and then and then catwoman killed him catwoman just shot him in the face he killed him and he died so roman roman science black mask is dead killed by catwoman however he wasn't the only black mask we have jeremiah arkham jeremiah arkham was this doctor this psychiatrist dude at arkham asylum i think he was the one in charge of arkham asylum so yeah but he gets a mental breakdown he goes crazy and he decided to become black mask he dons a black mask identity and he, this was like during the time with dick grayson aka the first robin who became nightwing this was during the time that dick grayson became batman because bruce wang aka batman the main batman died so yeah uh, eventually Bruce Wayne came back because no one stays in comics so yeah but anyway this was during Dick was Batman and stuff and he fought against Jeremiah Ar Ar Jeremiah Arkham Black Mass so yeah and he made Bla his Black Mass gang into like the cult style and stuff so yeah 
And then obviously the new 52 happened, uh, Flashpoint, then new 52 happened, and new 52 brought back Roman Sionis, which he wasn't in it as much as I can remember. Then DC Rebirth, and you know, he's back to being Black Mass and stuff. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. There's not much to his character. However, a lot of people find him popular from the Arkham Origins games or whatever, the Arkham games, so yeah. But anyway, um, that's it. That's everything you need to know about Black Mass. Now I'm going to tell you his powers and abilities. He does have powers. So, like I said, Black Mass is very similar to Kimpin, so he's like this crime boss, and he has resources, he has money, he has men, he knows he can manipulate people, he can interrogate people, he knows how to cover up a scene, so he knows a lot about criminology, he has weapons and guns, you know, he knows hand-to-hand -hand combat, you know, has marksmanship, and all that stuff, he has like these toxic gas and stuff, he, is, he has a lot of things here, yeah, he's a pretty dangerous dude, and he is capable of a lot of things. So yeah, but anyway, there you go guys, um, here's an image of Black Mask in the Birds of Prey film, it looks pretty dope, so yeah. But anyway guys, that's pretty much everything you need to know, I know I left out a few details, but like I said, that's all you need to know, that's like my summary. So yeah, thanks for watching, please like, hit the button to, um, sh to know notifications and stuff, subscribe, comment down below if you're excited for Birds of Prey, and yeah, thanks for watching, peace.